All right, so what is good, everybody? This is, of course, your boy, B. Bullet RC, coming to you guys again with yet another oiliv. And today, I mean, let's just start off by counting off the boxes, okay? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We got thirteen dubs right here. We got the early heat, we got retail dubs, and a gifted pair salutes. So if y'all ready, I need y'all to sit back, relax, make sure you drop that like on this bit, finesse the bell if you haven't already, and sub up. Listen, we have to please the algorithm guys. They watch. I also want to let y'all know that if you missed out on the brown V2 pair trooper pants, we are dropping a black pair. Some people were asking where we're going to restock the brown pair. No, the brown pair will not be restocking at this time, but the black pair will be dropping on April 2nd. That is this Saturday. Same details, same adjustable fit, zippers down there at the ankle, so you can adjust them like I mentioned before on the latest heater hype. As of now, all we have left on the brown, I think is maybe medium and XL. After I mentioned them last time, y'all basically went in there and cleaned this out. So, the same thing, all black dropping this Saturday, April 2nd, 8 p.m. Eastern time. Follow at S-M-P-L-I-N-D. Link is always in description. Make sure you are there at eight to get your size. I can't guarantee that it's just gonna be sitting there for you to easily get. As you can see, the brown sizes are gone. Now let's go ahead and get it started. If there is a shoe outside of a box, that is because I need the box to sell off some other shoes because yes, some of y'all might be asking, yo Bull, I thought you were trying to sell some of your sneak collection or a lot of your sneakers. Yes, I am. As you can see, I'm not doing a good job. First box we're gonna get into is this one right here. Now this, again, a retail dub manual off of social status. I got this in my size, size 12. And first off, I gotta say, yo, social status, this box. This box goes crazy. So lose to everybody out there who actually keeps their boxes. I mean, look at the side. Prestige, power, prosperity, main swoosh, ISAs, laces. I mean, you got everything on here. Wear after opening. So let me go ahead and open these joints up. This was the Nike and social status dunk mid. I would have liked a lower high, but the mid is cool. Even the inside of the paper. Got the little school kids with the social status and the Nike logos. And this was part of the free lunch pack. And down to the box, to the way that they did the shoe, I think they executed on these beautifully. Now there was a chocolate milk and a strawberry milk colorway. And this is of course a strawberry milk one. This was my favorite colorway. And it was a pretty, Easy cop. Y'all know the new way to battle the bots or whatever people are using now is to uh, ask a quick question. I think there was a question and a capture for this release. And yo, here's a quick close up view of the shoe. Quality materials all over crazy. And I really like the jewel milk swoosh on this joint. From the box to the shoe to the materials to the theme, idea, execution, they killed it on this one. Now for the next shoe out the stack, I don't have as many nice things to say about it. It is back here. And um, yeah, you already know what time it is. I got exclusive access to these on the Adidas Confirmed app. And when they offer me exclusive access, I said, you know what? I'll at least buy them and try them out because I know that I'm not gonna be paying resale for these. And y'all already see them. Y'all know what time it is. The Dumpling Yeezys, the Gyoza 450s are in the studio. And uh, I took them out the box. I think I looked at these once and I just, I kind of made my mind, bro. This just looks like it's a shoe for somebody with a narrow foot, and I'm not one of those people. And uh, these are definitely Basuda, bro. Basuda alert, Basuda alert. The 450s is in the building, bro. Listen, like I said, I ain't got a lot nice to say about these. They come squished up in this little Yeezy 450 box just smashed together. Um, yeah, this, this don't even, you get your shoe and it looks like this on the top all smashed down. That just don't even look good to me. So these right here, I might just try one on after the vid, but right now this is looking like my first and last pair of 450s that y'all are gonna see on the channel. It is what it is. Okay, let's grab, let's get this. This is a more recent pickup, and this was a sneakers dub. And listen, anytime I get a dub on sneakers, I'm surprised. This joint, you know, when I enter on sneakers, I open the app, I enter in, and I literally just close the app and stop looking. Because either it's gonna give me that quick L, the quick dub, or it's not gonna say nothing for an hour and then update me and let me know that I didn't get them. Either way, it's fine. 
Y'all see the box, blam, nothing else in here. And yes, I was actually able to get this shoe for retail in my size, and that is the Muslin 3s. Not only did I get a 12, I actually copped a 11 and a half locally as well. So I was able to hit twice over for retail. And I don't need to say much more about this shoe. I just wanted to show it off that yes, after a little while, I was able to hit on another pair of shoes on Nike sneakers. I did a full review on this shoe already. I've talked about this shoe. I've talked this shoe to death, so yes. I don't know if sneakers is listening to me, but they knew I really wanted this dove, and I guess they let me have it this time. Okay, next box is right here, and I'm gonna tell you like this. I got this shoe early, and I didn't do the video. As y'all already know, it was explained. Some things were going on, and the video stuff was not the top of my priority list at the time. But I did still secure these. Salusa Plan With Heat, that's where I got this pair for right here. They are on IG. And Air Jordan 4 box. Slide them out that bubble wrap. The Air Jordan 4, and I got these. And I'm gonna be honest, seen a lot of pairs of these going around. I seen the restocks. And I also seen some of the QC on some of these pairs, but this is the red Thunder Air Jordan 4. And I don't know, these is actually pretty clean. Let me put it this way. I like this shoe more than what I thought I would like. You know, of course I love my yellow OG Thunders, but now we have this black and red pair and um, I'm probably gonna end up sitting on these for a little while. I don't know when I'm gonna break them out, but something about this particular pair of fours is making me not want to let it go. I just think it's an easy to wear colorway. It's a solid colorway. And the red on these joints right here, it pops. The red Thunder fours, you know, it's, it was a solid release. All right, real quick, editor bull here. I messed up and press record and end the record, blah, 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 blah. I messed up anyways. The next shoe that was going to be unboxed was right here. This was another shoe that I got a sneakers dub on. Retail dub, straight Nike sneakers. It is what it is. Now, when I got the box, the box was definitely smashed on these joints. And unfortunately, as y'all can see, the corner of my box did take a little damage. But it is all good. Size 12. Y'all see the shiny black and red Nike Jordan box. This is, of course, an Air Jordan 1. And inside of the box, we did have these joints right here, which were the red air drum one so this was another shoe that was actually able to get y'all know i do get lucky here and there and this was another shoe that uh, i had the luck of the draw on so now that we got these out of the way box included hey quickly make sure you drop a like on this bit if you like the view come check me out on twitch bro twitch.t forward slash bullet rc probably be live tonight okay these out the way Let's get back to uh, the regular studio view. Of course, you got the Nike Air with the family embroidered on the inside of these. And that was another sneakers dub. Now, the next box I got into was right here, but I didn't press the record button and didn't record anything. So, the next shoe we have is right here in this all-over black Air Jordan box. Now, as soon as you see the name, you should already know. This was a woman's shoe, and this was the Women's Air Jordan 15 Retro SP. Retail was 225, and the colorway on these was stone, and this is the Billie Eilish collab. I do like the little hits of green. I'm like switching up the little size and tag just a bit. And this is just a shoe that you don't see often. First off, because of the number. Second off, because of the collab. And it was some that I just don't have a lot of in my collection and I want to try this one out. And that is of course right here, that is the Billie Eilish Air Jordan 15. Definitely not something that's gonna be for everybody and I think that was the point. To pick a 15 for a collab, hey, it's kinda bold, I ain't gonna lie to you. Out of all the shoes you could've picked, this was the one. So yeah, this was just another random pickup. I actually copped these off of Billie Eilish's store, the one and only time I shopped on her store, but Hey, I was able to get through. This was a women's size 13, so this is a men's 11 and a half, and I should be able to make that work. Hey, give me one word to describe these down below in the comments. Looking forward to see what y'all say, but yeah, I cop these right here. Up next, another box that we got right here is a big one, and you know, I had to have this shoe right here. There was no way I wasn't gonna get it. Inside, all over white, LeBron James, King James logo. Slide them out. We have what was once and near unobtainable sneaker retroed by Nike and LeBron collectors. Like I said before, y'all are eating. I say y'all because I don't really see myself as a LeBron collector. I just 
cop a couple pairs here and there that I like. And if we flip these open, yes. I mean, the Watch the Thrones. I mean, come on. Come on now. This was a very easy, easy cop. Even coming with the piece on the top. The crazy pattern on the laces. I mean, this was just off rip. Easy, easy, I was in. This is one right here that I'm sure y'all have seen, but I wanna just give it its respect real quick on the cam. Some of y'all just don't know about this and that's cool. There will be no Watch the Throne disrespect on this channel and uh, yeah, man, I did get my pair. Was able to grab mine in a size 13 because if you get them in your true size, your toes will be snapping off. Fire LeBron, classic LeBron, crazy LeBron right here. Now for this next box, I am just gonna go ahead and step back because I know what's in it and it is a big, heavy package. Salute to Champs, salute to the homie Jay. I would have opened this up a lot sooner, but this was sent to the old Addy, bro. Like I said, a big, heavy box and on the front of this, it says open immediately for your enjoyment. All right, so we're gonna, oh, oh, oh. Oh no, I'm not cleaning that up. I, I Thank you for the paper, I'm not cleaning that up. Okay, here is the box right here. Again, salutes, Puma, White Castle. I just zoomed it in real quick so y'all could actually see the packaging for yourself. Chimps, Puma, White Castle. Blam, there is the card right there. Damn, even have my name on it. Y'all, I'm sorry that I opened this up late. I changed the Addy, I will hit you, bro. My name is even on these joints. And we pull this out. There was attention to detail with this, and I definitely appreciate that. And we have more, more of the party paper on the inside. They even include free slider coupons that expire, oh, they don't expire until the 31st of 2022, so we still good. Got a tee in here, and it looks like there's also a hoodie. At this point, I'm gonna have to clean it up off the ground, so it is what it is. When I take my talents to White Castle, blam, I'm gonna be ready. Another box to break into, top, bottom, flip it, flop it, and we have the actual shoe on the inside the puma and white castle pair of rsx's even got the white castle back there on the back and even on the tongue you know i love myself a good pair of rsx's so salutes i appreciate these again salutes puma salutes champs i do appreciate y'all and these are probably available right now now these next three right here we're gonna hit all three of them together three piece combo Okay, we hit the full three pack on all of these joints right here. Now I did pre-order the 650s and they should be here very soon. So be looking for a video on that. But I had luck on the draw for every single pair in my size. So let's just break it down. ALD, New Balance, size 12. Y'all should see by the boxes full three pack. This is the white and navy blue pair of ALD. 550s. Cream on the midsole, white leather on the upper, that crackled leather or that crackled suede right there on the New Balance logo. It's the ALD joints, you already know. Then I grab the next one. Y'all see it? Okay, another pair, New Balance, ALD, size 12 for me. And this is definitely going to be my favorite pair, my favorite colorway is the white and gray pair. The white and gray was my most wanted pair from that original drop, but the prices were so crazy. At first, like 500 and 600 for a pair of 550s, and I was like, nah. So when I had a chance to enter for the raffle, hey, I was blessed with a pair. And then on to Numero Trace. Number three, we have the last one, but definitely not the least. And this was the last delayed W that they gave me, and this was on the pair of the original white and green ALD 550s. So I went from hitting on one pair of ALDs from before and then I hit on all three. If I just, hold on, let me step right here. Green, blue, gray. All copped for retail. So Lucy ALD, that's where I got them from, into the raffle and I got lucky. Okay, we almost done. We're almost done, we almost out of here. Two more. First thing first, I'm gonna get into this one. And uh, this one, I know exactly what it is. And it was one of my favorite new colorways of Yeezys. Yes, Yeezys. I got these off of Adidas Confirm for, again, retail duh. And I want to say that I actually hit on a 12 and a half. Is this a 12 or a 12 and a half? This is a size 12. When is the last time that y'all have seen new 350s on channel? It's been a little while, but this was a good colorway. I tried for it, and I hit. And that is the MX Oat colorway of 
the Yeezy 350s. I want y'all to really see what I'm talking about. The pattern on this upper. The way that's all knit together is... I mean, in my opinion, it's fire. And I definitely like this colorway more than the uh, the rock joints, the black and brown. You know, it, it works, it's black and brown, but I thought that the more wild orange, blue, cream colorway was a little bit better, but you know, that's just me. So yes, I did cop a new pair of Yeezys and uh, you know, they're not entirely tan, but they got some tan on them. Okay, Editor Bull back in the building once again because I did the same thing twice actually three times during this video but i'm not gonna get into it listen this was the early heat the last pickup of the video now these drop in about two weeks i want to say i think april 9th is the date if i'm not mistaken and they do come in the special jordan box as y'all can see red jordan jump man on the top size and label is down there but the light is so bright it might be blasting out just a little bit but i did get them in size 12 retail on these says 190 and i feel like this shoe got pushed back maybe once or twice and on the inside of this box if we go ahead and open it up we have the brand new jade horizon air jordan 5 and this is an interesting interesting new retro of a jet especially on the air jordan 5 because the whole idea behind this jade horizon pair is that it is aged on the bottom it ain't no blue ice man we got that piss yellow sole exclusive on these joints right here and it's the same thing they did on the off-white fives i don't think most people really mind it because if you have fives if you wear them this is what happens eventually and that was the idea and the theme behind this shoe right here a worn age air jordan 5 i will say right off the rip that these materials it's like a super super soft leather i'll make sure to check on nike sneakers before i drop the full review just to see if i can get some more info on these materials and then that entire upper that jade horizon colorway one thing you cannot say about this jordan 5 is that it is another bs colorway this is not no black and red, black and blue stuff that usually works. This is something really outside of the normal box for an Air Jordan 5. I mean, even the outsole, this is not black. This is like a really, really dark navy blue. White shark teeth with the black paint splatter on them. Jump into the tongue, still reflective. And the embroidery on these and even the guts is this kind of worn white color as y'all can see on the inside of the shoe drawing jump man on the back no nike air on this pair but that was expected so after all the leaks over and over finally getting official images i finally have the shoe in hand and i am half and half on this shoe i think it is a good shoe i just think that it is going to be a harder to wear colorway but definitely a unique colorway don't get me wrong y'all already know that the full review is gonna be on the way for this shoe and with that i mean that's it bro that was the early heat the jade horizons and be looking out for that review very soon and since i messed up my outro didn't record it let's do it here bro make sure y'all go ahead and drop a like on this bitch sub up if you haven't already and finesse the bell as well much love to all the fan followers and, of course, supporters. You guys can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, SoundCloud, Twitch. The Twitch is Bullet RC, by the way, here, there. Plus, of course, even in the studio setup, Bullet RC. And I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Y'all let me know off the first impression. Are y'all feeling these Jade Horizons? I'm going to see you on the next one. Much love. I'm actually done editing. This is my last clip. I'm going to see you on the next one. Peace. <laughs> Take some, there's a lot more where that came from, and it really is.